Suzanne Sabakis's life reads like a grim novel, yet it is a horrifying reality. Born in 1969, Suzanne's beginnings were like any other child's, until a man named Franklin Delano Floyd entered her life. Suzanne's mother, Sandy, married Floyd, unaware of the dark future he heralded. In 1975, Suzanne, her siblings, and Sandy found themselves at the mercy of Floyd's manipulative grasp. When Suzanne's mother was incarcerated for a minor offense, Floyd took advantage of the chaos to abduct Suzanne and her two sisters, spiriting them away into an uncertain fate. This began Suzanne's tragic odyssey, a harrowing flight through time and states, under various aliases, shedding her true identity like a snake sheds its skin. Floyd remodeled her into Sharon Marshall, molding her into a pawn for his sinister desires. By the age of eight, she was laboring under the heavy burden of Floyd's control, a carefully manipulated victim of his twisted schemes. Suzanne, as Sharon, was torn between stolen childhood dreams and grim realities. She excelled academically, earning scholarships and drawing dreams of being an aerospace engineer, all while living under the constant threat of Floyd's unpredictable wrath. The climax of this tragic tale came in 1990. There, Suzanne became Tanya Hughes and married Floyd under duress. Her life slid further into a dark abyss until she was found fatally injured by a roadside, the victim of a hit and run. Her official identification as Tanya Hughes brought forward more questions than answers. The revelation of Tanya's true identity only came after Floyd was arrested for multiple crimes, including a sordid connection to her son Michael's disappearance. DNA analysis brought Suzanne's tragic existence to light, unraveling a saga of lies, cruelty, and stolen innocence. Girl in the Picture isn't just the chilling story of Suzanne Savakis, it is a heart-wrenching narrative of a life lost to deception and control. True crime enthusiasts will find themselves gripped by every twist, every revelation, and the sheer capacity for human evil laid bare in this grim, compelling tale.